Hey guys, good morning. Good morning from Indy. Welcome back to my channel. Um, it is currently Wednesday, right? Yeah, it's Wednesday, sorry, I didn't think about that. Um, and it is about eight o'clock right now. I was going to get Scarlett up, um, cause I woke up at 7.30, which is pretty much what time I wake up every single day, but she fell back asleep. So she's been sleeping for a long time. Actually, it's almost 8.20. Um, do you see this puppy love right now? Hi, buddy. You giving your mama some loves. Hi, bud. It is almost 8.40 and she's still not awake. And um, I've been using these Trader Joe coffee cups still. This is the dark roast, but I definitely don't like them. I don't, and I don't recommend them if you like a dark coffee. So, and then I did switch my coffee creamer as well. Let me show you. So this is the one like I've always used. This is the Coffee Mate um, and this is the Caramel Macchiato. I just can't get away from creamer, you guys. Like this is like what makes my coffee. Um, but I recently switched over to the Caramel Simply Pure and this is really good. I don't think it's much better for you to be honest. I don't really think any kind of cream is good for you. Um, but I just can't, oops, I didn't shake that up. I just can't let my creamer go. It's just one of those like splurges that I'm just not ready to let go of. Good morning, sleepyhead. Good morning. Hi. Did you miss me? You smell like you need a diaper change. You smell like you need a diaper change. You do. You slept in today. Are you so tired? <laughs> Are you so excited to start your day? Say happy Wednesday. <laughs> Hi, okay, let's get you up. guys check out Scarlett's new toy <laughs> how cute is this this is the um, Juby tricycle and I showed you guys this on my Instagram but this is like a little tricycle for Scarlett um, and she absolutely loves it mainly because it has a little cup holder here and I always put Cheerios in it <laughs> but um, yeah we are absolutely loving this thing it was fairly easy to put together um, this is a little sunshade hold on so this comes down and it will like protector from the Arizona sun and then this transitions with them as they get a little bit older so some of these pieces will come off so she can actually ride this herself and then um, and then this piece back here this is what steers it so it's really easy to steer to be honest and we are loving this there's a little compartment down here Scarlett do you love your new tricycle? She's also wearing her turban from Little Knots, which we love. And then this onesie is says Buck Wild on it, and it's from me and Baby Designs. So we're actually going to go try and get a few pictures of her in this onesie. So we shall see how that goes. Halloween in the desert. <laughs> the giant cactus. interested I don't think I told you guys this but I have discount codes for Scarlett's outfit um, I don't for the juicy juvy tricycle but I do for the outfit so I will link them down below because I can't remember them off the top of my head so um, if you guys want to check them out they'll be down there are you swinging so much fun say we just took our pictures really fast and now we are enjoying some time at the park. Cannot wait till Scarlett can play on all of this.
Here we go. One, two, three. It's fun swinging, huh? Hi guys, so I just showered and put some makeup on and I am going to curl my hair because I have been not really getting myself ready and I'm just, since I've been working out and I just am feeling a need today since I'm taking a day off from working out, I want to get myself presentable because some days you just need to do that. But anyways, as I'm doing this, I thought I would take a chance to give you guys a couple updates. I want to update you guys on is my working out, my new workout. Um, so, if you guys follow me on Snapchat or Instagram, you may already know some of this, but for those of you who don't follow me or maybe new to my channel, I started working out a couple days ago and we are utilizing the daycare that they have there. Um, and the very first time I put Scarlett in the daycare, she lasted about 30 minutes, which was better than I thought she would do. But I took her there again yesterday and she lasted 22 minutes, so did not get a good workout in. Um, I had to actually go back later when Ty could watch her. I do think the reason that she started crying and they had to come get me was because she had a dirty diaper. And I know a lot of you have been reaching out to me saying that they should be changing her diapers and stuff, but like I get that and that would be nice. But for the price you pay, like we only, it's a $10 add-on to our gym membership for the daycare so it's really not that expensive so you pay what you get for and I actually don't mind that they have to come get me to change her diaper because I don't know I would just rather like change her diaper myself I don't know if that sounds like anal but I don't really want a stranger changing my baby's diaper but I'm going to keep trying to do this whole daycare thing um, the very first time I took her there was so many kids like so many kids and I took her in the morning um, so I have figured out that it's better for her if I take her in the afternoon or the evenings because they don't open until 4 if I take her later in the day because it's not near as busy and I think it's not as overwhelming for her um, so yeah that's kind of what I'm doing or I will just go when uh, Ty is able to be home to watch her some of you guys have asked why doesn't Ty watch Scarlett while I work out and here's the issue Ty also is big into fitness and he also likes to go to the gym and so like last night I went to a class without Scarlett so he came home I left I went to my class and then when I came home, like he put her to bed and then when I came back Ty left to go to the gym um, for about an hour and then came back and then it's bedtime so like we didn't have like any kind of communication or like we just weren't able to like spend time together at all so that's the issue that I'm currently having is the, the point is it's a really hard finding a balance and I feel like if we can make this whole daycare thing work it's gonna be best for all of us because then even like Ty and I can have like a gym date we can drop her off at the daycare there and then go work out together like we used to do before we had a baby so um, I don't know so I'm about to reapply some of this Tanceuticals and I've been using this for a couple, well about a week now you guys, and I don't have enough good things to say about this. I do wish I would have gotten a darker shade, um, but overall I am really loving this product. So if you guys are looking for a self tanner, definitely make sure to check out Tanceuticals. I haven't applied Tanceuticals for probably about three days, but I still feel like I have a little bit of color. Um, I'm definitely not like overly tan, so it's definitely a more natural look, which uh, my husband seems to really like. I personally wish it was darker, but um, any color is color for me, so I am really liking it. Also, this top that I'm wearing, it's super cute. It has like this cutout detail up top too. Um, this is from Shop Pink Blush, and I will link it down below for you guys if I can find it. Um, and then I tied it up right here. This is like, I did this myself. Um, I also got in a really cute, I need to make my bed still and do laundry, but um, this is also super cute. I got this in from Pink Blush as well. There's Indy. Um, so it's like a little overpiece, it's short sleeves. I'll be posting an Instagram post on it. And then um, it also like ties in the front. So I don't know, I love the chiffon material. Oh, and then also, I had a couple of you guys ask me for a discount code for our new mattress, which you guys, I am loving. I don't really care for the pillows that came with it. They're a little too stiff for me. If you guys like a stiff pillow, these would be great. Um, but I just use these to like lean up against my bed to watch TV. Um, but I do have a discount code for our Nectar mattress, and I will link it down below for you guys in case you guys want to check out their mattresses. 
It's lunchtime and Scarlett's eating some vegetable fried rice from Trader Joe's because it's like all we have. We're actually going to head to the store here in a second because we have no food. I tried to, I'm gonna try to also give her the rest of this. It's a happy baby apples, guava, and beets. So Scarlett just got dressed and <laughs> she's ready for the day. And you guys, I'm seriously obsessed with these little ponytails right now. I actually just um, ordered some little clip bows for her hair so we can put a little bow in her hair still. Let's not grab all the clothes. Let's not do that. Um, her eczema is actually really starting to clear up, but her cheeks are super rosy today. I think that might be like a teething thing. I don't know. Um, but we're heading out the door. We're gonna go to Trader Joe's and possibly Sprouts that's right next door and pick up some groceries. Hi, are you ready to go into Trader Joe's and get out of there? Are you gonna be a good girl and not scream? I'm a little scared because you're being a little testy. What are you doing? Hi guys, we just got home. And I tried a new drink at Starbucks. Um, this is a venti iced um, skinny vanilla latte and I've gotten these hot before and I really like them but I do not like it cold at all. And I, I think I've come to realize that my Starbucks drink, my just it's just the regular iced coffee sweetened with cream. Um, I am going to stick with that and I'm not gonna do anything else because that's like the one thing that I really enjoy and the one thing that I'm just not ready to give up even though it's not the best for you. Anyways, I just put Scarlett down for a nap and I just asked you guys on Snapchat and Instagram if you wanted to see another grocery haul because we just went to the grocery store. We went to Sprouts and we went to Trader Joe's. So I don't know if you guys have a Sprouts. I don't know if those are just in Arizona. I'm really not quite sure. Um, but I thought I'd show you guys what we got because you guys said you wanted to see. So it's a good thing that I put Scarlett down for a nap and then just did my grocery haul and started editing it because I'm getting really bad at this. But I accidentally put my finger over the speaker so you guys could not hear me at all. So my entire grocery haul was just awful and I'm not gonna put that on my blog. Um, so I had everything laid out really nice there to show you guys like I did in my last grocery haul, but I'm just going to take you through my pantry and my <laughs> Uh, refrigerator and I'll just show you what I got that way instead um, Also, I do want to let you guys know I spent a total of $80 I spent $50 at Trader Joe's and then I spent $30 at Sprouts So I'll just show you this way and it'll be just fine. Okay, keep in mind. This is definitely not organized but I Already opened these I actually didn't eat it. Um, I have it laying right here Because uh, I ate something else, but um, I'm going to try these these are an organic brown rice marshmallow treat from Trader Joe's um, I got these for my husband. These are just some pretzel slims. He likes to snack on those We picked up some more of the peanut butter sandwich crackers from Trader Joe's um, No Trader Joe's trip is complete without grabbing a box of these. These are vegan. These are uh, gluten-free. Um, these are like the best soft baked snickerdoodles I've ever had. So we love those. Stick that there for a second. Um, these oyster crackers I love to snack on. I don't know what it is about them. But they're super good. So um, to fast forward to sprouts, I got some of these organic brown rice. Um, I don't know what you call these rice cakes. I'm gonna have Scarlett eat these I thought I could put some peanut butter on these or I don't know just have her snack on them um, I also picked up some syrup and I actually just ate waffles So I used some of that syrup and it looks like I used a ton, but I really didn't use that much um, But I just picked this up from sprouts um, What else I think that's all of the oh and then I grabbed some bread from sprouts as well Just some nature's own so that's everything that I got in my pantry for the frozen stuff, um, these are my favorite waffles from Trader Joe's. I absolutely love these. I pair them with fruit and then a little bit of syrup and they're so good. They're multi-grain and sometimes I'll feed these to Scarlet as well. I made the mistake of accidentally buying gluten-free ones and these are not good <laughs> at all. Maybe it's just because I can tell they're gluten-free but they taste like cardboard to me. But Scarlet eats them so I will feed those to her sometimes. Um, and then also for frozen stuff from Trader Joe's, I got some mac and cheese. I thought this would be a good um, like lunch or something for Scarlett. Um, this looks so good. 
This is a sweet potato gnocchi, so um, I thought this would be really good to try with Scarlet as well. I picked up some mixed vegetables from Trader Joe's. Um, we still have these. I haven't opened these yet. These are the French macarons, and these are a great little sweet treat. I love these. Um, we got some vegetable fried rice, which I love. That's everything in there. And then in here, um, I don't know why these are in here, actually. These are uh, cold brew latte dessert bars, and these have seven grams of sugar, so they're not high, you know, super high in sugar, but... I don't know, these looked really good. I'm really excited about those. Oh, and then my cold brew coffee that I usually get, they're actually sold out completely. So hopefully they restock that soon, but I was not able to get any of that. I think that's everything in there. And then in my fridge, we picked up some more of the sweet potato ribbons. Um, this was really cool. These are honey roasted pumpkin ravioli. I don't know if I'm gonna like this, but I thought it'd be fun to give to Scarlett. Very festive. I grabbed some pico de gallo from Trader Joe's. I've never tried this. Um, picked up some strawberries from Sprouts. Back there is just some chicken breast from, uh, where did I get that, Trader Joe's. Um, I grabbed two things of almond milk because I use these for my smoothies and for my oatmeal, and then Ty uses these for his pro protein drinks. Um, this, so I told you guys, I think on uh, Instagram, that I got this at Trader Joe's, and I was completely wrong. I actually got this at Sprouts. Um, but this is just coconut water, and I really, really like it. And I actually give this to Scarlet as well. I'll put half, half this and then half water in a sippy cup just for something different. And she loves it. Um, I grabbed some carrots because this is like Scarlet's new favorite food. And um, I just boil these in the water and then um, make sure they're really soft to give them to her. Question for you guys. Have you heard that eating too many carrots makes your nose turn orange like for babies? Because I swear it happened. I'm looking back at like a couple vlogs, maybe two vlogs ago. And I think, I think Scarlet's nose was orange because she has been eating a lot of carrots. So let me know if that's like real or if that's happened to your baby. I'm just curious. Okay, and then what else? Oh, I grabbed some more of this um, honey crisp apple cider. You guys, I've showed, the, showed you this before, but this one's almost gone. Um, but I love it because I absolutely love this cider because it's just honey crisp apples, as you can see in the ingredients. So nothing's added, it's very fresh. Um, I will drink this hot or drink it cold either way, but I love it. Um, what else? I think that might be, oh, I grabbed a yogurt too. Scarlett loves eating this Greek yogurt for breakfast. I will just put this like half, I'll feed half of it to her and then save the other half for like another day. And then over here, these I'm really excited about. These are a green plum cot. So I don't know what the heck they are, but they look cool and I like fruit a lot. So trying these should be interesting. Um, also, whoa, <laughs> I also grabbed some bananas. I really want to make some banana bread, so we'll see if these don't get eaten. I'll probably make banana bread. And then I grabbed a couple nectarines as well. Okay, and then the last thing that I purchased was this plant, and I thought this would go really cute in our bedroom. Um, this is our new dresser, by the way. I don't think I've showed you guys that. Um, but I want to start adding some, like, actual plants to our bedroom, so I thought this would go really good. Um, I think it's a little too big for this pot, to be honest, so I'm gonna have to get a new one. I'm not quite sure. We'll see how it goes. Um, I don't know, let me know, does that look right? I'm not really like super knowledgeable about my plants. I honestly don't even know what this plant is, so if you guys have any idea, let me know down below. So that sums up our Trader Joe's and Sprouts haul. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. Sorry it was a bit chaotic with everything being already put away. Live and learn. I'd rather do it that way than have a video where you can't hear me. So um, yeah, you guys, I think that's everything for today. I think I'm gonna end the vlog because I think it's getting a little too long. So I will talk to you guys in my next video. If you guys have any questions at all, list them down below. Also make sure to check out the links below with the discount codes. I do have some discount codes I'm gonna list. And if you guys haven't already, make sure to follow me on Snapchat and Instagram. I try to be very interactive with you guys on there. I absolutely love interacting with my subscribers, so definitely check that out. And also give this video a thumbs up if you guys enjoyed it, and we will see you guys in our next video. Bye guys.